Hello, my name is Captain Clint with Go Sail Arizona, and I am selling my personal Catalina Capri 16, my beloved Capri 16. I love this boat, uh, such an easy boat to trailer, but this is a short video on uh, just some close-ups and some details on some of her equipment. Uh, so she does sit on a nice caravan trailer with perfect tires, uh, all the lights work, uh, no connection issues, no issues coming to pick the boat up. Um, so uh, on the transom here you can see um, that is for lowering the mast it does extend up it sits right in the gudgeons on the transom of the boat so lowering the mast by one person is is super easy to do um, so just a couple of easy a uh, couple of close-ups of the furler here it is a furled up 90 percent jib which is standard for the boat um, and it's on a Schaefer roller furling so it's pretty nice to easily uh, deploy uh, just a couple of quick shots of the trailer and such. Uh, these are a couple of uh, tears that are in just the cover of the sail, and that cover is on a separate halyard that hoists. Uh, so if you're keeping the boat on the trailer and whatnot, I will have that sewn prior to, or uh, I guess I can, you know, take five bucks off if you're gonna get it sewn. Um, all Harkin uh, cam cleats uh, and such. Uh, throughout the boat. This is a little storage pocket for what halyards you have. You can see I've got them all cut short. Uh, they do lengthen obviously when the sails are up. Um, this also opens up and you can see one of the nice features of this boat is uh, getting some uh, life jackets, maybe putting a cooler down there and such. Uh, also down there was the uh, sail top. It's an in, not an inflatable but a padded sail top so if the boat ever capsizes and you want it, it uh, keeps the boat from going turtle uh, completely upside down. Uh, so you can see this is the, uh, the keel. It swings up. It's very nice. It's on a little cam cleat, a little Harkin cam cleat over on the port side of the sole in the uh, in the cockpit so uh, you do have some nice straps to keep you seated and such um, all the rigging all the lines everything's in great condition uh, there's nothing that needs to be replaced I've got a lot of snap shackles in use uh, throughout the boat uh, and push pins that are very easy to uh, take apart the boat make sure it, it gets highway ready in under 15 minutes so that's one of the reasons I got it I'm, I like going fast on small boats I like catamarans uh, especially the Prindles the Hobies and such but they uh, I like the idea of going out clipping around the lake really quick but also having a boat that you know can hold some other people and have to and be able to sit up more of on a bench seat versus uh, Indian style. But you can see the tires on the trailer are nice. Trailer's in excellent condition. There's just, there's just no issues with this boat. It's in perfect condition. So uh, uh, you'll see here in a second, I'll show you some of the, uh, uh, the main sail uh, does have a bag for it. And there's an outboard three and a half Nissan uh, four stroke, which is in uh, excellent condition as well. Uh, the rudder I don't have on the boat because you can see I've got the stand for uh, putting the putting the mast down uh, and also that stays up to hold the mast uh, while you're going down the highway. Uh, so either way, um, but that's where obviously the rudder would connect, uh, but I'll show you that in a second. It's in perfect condition as long with the tiller and I've got two extensions. Uh, one's a Ronstadt, one's a Harkin extension. One's a little longer than the other, but this is the Nissan Marine. You can see it's three and a half. Uh, low emission engine runs great nice and shiny nice and new I don't like putting old junky engines on nice clean boats so uh, this one will actually make the boat plane out uh, at about 10 knots um, you can see mainsail mainsail is in perfect condition it's obviously an original but there are no stains or anything like that uh, it's not as crisp as it once was but uh, either way um, and then you can see the two extensions I use the longer one so I can sit forward when I single hand uh, keep the bow down keep a faster boat uh, but easy to uh, drive, operate the main sheet and the jibs on this boat when single handing. I've had the boat in, in 23 knots, was a little much for that boat, but I did put a reef in it because there is a reef on the main. And, and uh, either way, she sails real nice, uh, super manageable boat for just an easy, easy out to the lake, put the mast up, go sail, put the mast down, bring it home, put it back in the garage. Uh, and that's kind of what I got it for, but with also the option of going fast and uh, racing if you wanted to. So, but cool, cool boat. Uh, love it. If you're interested, give us a call.